Alrighty. Hello, hello everybody. This is Kirusha here, and now, before we begin, let me just say something. I'm in the mood to record some mini shots tonight. So, I'm gonna do that. Now, let me begin. This story is one I know is quite interesting. Because before I've made a concept about Deku being the Yandere, but now I get to show off that Deku has to deal with one. Anyways, with that being said, let us jump right into it. We will start with Izuku Midoriya. Izuku, his life is interesting. A little boring? <laughs> maybe, maybe it might just be that one. Whenever he was younger, he found out he was quirkless. And that was interesting. His mother was quite apologetic about it. He thought he could be a hero, but then as he grew older, he realized that that was not a possibility. Eventually, he grew out of that childhood idea. Try and look for a more realistic look at the world. I mean, people can fly, shoot lasers, control elements, control stuff with their minds, and... He's just human. Eventually, Izuku, he got out of high school and got a job. He was able to make his own path in the world. He started to settle in, get nice and comfortable. One day, he moved out of his parents' place, and he got a place of his own. He got into a routine, made friends, had fun, and that was it. Life as usual. And we do currently have today. Where is Zuku? He does want to sit at work. Typing things in the computer. For someone, they do could appear over his cubicle. Talking about it. Yo. Hmm? Uh, what is it? I'm a little behind on a few things. <laughs> Hopefully not that behind. A few of us are thinking about going out for drinks later. What about you? Are you going to try and stay late? Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. But I really should get this done before tomorrow. You know how it is. We got a little bit of a tight deadline. And if I'm late tomorrow, I think I won't get this done. You're just coming a little early. <laughs> right. Right, if only it was that easy. Come on, man. What are you working on? Are you working on that one project? A little bit. Just trying to fill these reports. Okay, okay. How about this? You helped me out a little bit with my work before, so if I help you finish that up a little early, you come up with drinks. Buy me and the guys around. How about that? Uh, y you know what? <laughs> sure. Don't got anything else really going on. <laughs> That's the spirit, man. Hey, and if we're lucky, maybe you can find yourself a cute girl at the bar. You know, maybe be a little late tomorrow after all. I don't think the boss will mind. Uh, sure, sure, but you know how she could be. Sometimes she's a little intense. Eh, that's fair. Alright then. Just, um, after lunch, tell me what you got. Send them over to me, send the files over to me, and I'll help out. Just tell me where to pick up from and where to stop, and I'll let you work around that. Also, uh, just let me know what you need me to make them say. If there's anything, uh, you know, that might give it away. Fine, fine. Just let me get back to work. Deku typing away. Lunch coming and going. And there is a little bit of time later. Where everyone, they all clocked out and headed to the bar. And right now, they sit there at the table. Deku, he's not really too sure. They get their drinks, and they do sit there. Deku looking around. Huh. 
Are you all right? I'm fine. <sighs> I'm fine. Just a little tired. Come on, man. Are you like that all the time? No, David, I'm not like that all the time. I'm just, you know. A little lonely, Izuku? <laughs> that's rich coming from you. Didn't you just get divorced? Ooh, that's a low blow, man. Maybe just dial it back a bit. Sorry, sorry, it's just... I don't usually come out to places like this, you know? So, where do you usually go? Eh, you know how it is. There's this one place I like to go to for lunch on my day off. Though, it's a bit interesting. It's kind of fun -y. Uh, Earth to Izuku? Ray, do you think he's fine? You alright, man? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm fine, I'm fine, just... You guys see the girl over there? Hmm? Uh, which one? Uh, the girl with black hair. Short and... Well, she's... Is she staring at you? Her looking at Deku. Right now, her going to give a bit of a wave. Deku waving back. And the guys, they do go to at least try and egg Deku on. Go over and talk to her. Uh, maybe not. I actually am surprised to see her here. Wait, you, you know her? Uh, kind of. I see her a lot at that place I go to. I've also seen her around town a little bit. It's a little weird. What do you mean? I mean, I, I don't know. I've ran into her a lot, but I don't really talk to her. <laughs> now that I think about it, she's here alone. Yikes. Why not provide her some company? I mean, do you guys think that that's a good idea? Uh, maybe. You said you wanted to do something different, right? This could be different. But how do you know her? I mean, well, I don't really know know her, but we've met before. Um, God, what was her name? I think her name was something with an S. S uh, no, 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 not that. Uh... S. No, no, there's an A in there somewhere. No, no, um, she, she was pretty, I, I don't know, my, my head was all fuzzy whenever it happened. Fuzzy? Yeah, yeah, she got into a fight with this guy and I kind of stepped in. Wait, was that last year when you had that bruise in your face? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. That's what happened? You told us not to worry about it. You never said you got into a fight. Ray, I mean, it just, it was nothing. This guy was messing with her and I stepped in. That's really it. That's all. Someone walking up. And this is where Deku, he does have a drink set in front of him. For the bartender... Talks about it. This is compliment to the young lady over there. Deku turning his head. Her writing with her hand on the table as her chin is set on it. Currently, Deku staring at her. And Izuku does get a turn. Uh, thanks. I mean, I was only going for a beer night, but... Oh, what is this? No, oh, it's a Cuba Libre. Lime juice, rum, and some soda. <laughs> Along some ice. It's a pretty decent drink, if I do say so myself. Not too fancy, not too simple. Just three ingredients. Oh, I uh, appreciate it. Thanks. Eh, I'm just the bartender, man. I'm pouring the drinks. Though, uh, make sure to 
tip me a little later? All right, I gotta go. The man walking down the row. Since a few people, they're currently turned away from down. And Izuku, he has a turn. Right now being egged on by his friends, they go talk to the mystery woman he saved. And Izuku, he does it down his beer. Currently him grabbing his drink and then going to stand. Making his way over as the girl, she does look a lot more alarmed. Since we do cut to her perspective. She's staring over at him, watching him sit there. And it's a little interesting. She's trying to be coy, or is that not the right word? No, no. Anonymous? No, bl blend in a little bit more into the background, but tonight she's feeling a little bit more adventurous. Seeing where things go, how things happen, maybe? Yeah, yeah, maybe. That's a good idea. Hmm. But if her plans do go bad tonight, then... Well, uh... There's definitely, definitely a possibility she might have to cut her chances and run. Cut her losses? Her looking up. Paying attention as Deku is walking across the bar. Her feeling internal panic before Deku does express. Is this seat taken? <laughs> no, no. Um, you, your name is Izuku, if I remember correctly? <laughs> sorry, sorry, I, I see you a lot around town. How have you been? I've been fine, um... I'm sorry, I, I don't remember your name. I I'm real bad about that. You're, you're right. That guy gave you a pretty bad blow to the head, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I don't know. Doctors thought I had a concussion, but they couldn't really tell. <laughs> it sounds like some pretty crappy doctors. Yeah. Her holding her hand out. Express that he can just call her Sylvia. Oh, Sylvia. <laughs> right. I was close. Oh, really? That's good. Though, I haven't seen you by the restaurant. Hmm? Uh, what do you mean? I mean, you're usually there a lot on Tuesdays, right? You order that one sandwich. Um, do I? I mean, I was a little behind on a few things, so I just packed a lunch that day. Really? Um, but you go there a lot, don't you? Uh, maybe a few times a week? Well, three or four maybe at most, but I don't know. Just been a little... I've had a busy week. There's a few busy projects coming up, and my mind's been all over the place. I do hope you understand. <laughs> You're right. Though, have you been? I actually am happy to be able to talk with you. <laughs> no problem. Though, what about you? Uh, that guy is still giving you troubles? Uh, oh, um, well, he hasn't been around as often, but I do see him every now and again. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean... He came around again last week, and to be honest with you, I'm not too sure if I should head home. I think he might be following me. I did get a new place and move across town, so that's been good. Seriously? You haven't reported him to the police? No, no, I've... Try to avoid that, for the most part. It's just... He's a little... Crazy. Y you know how he is. I report him to the heroes, and... Well, they've... Looked into it a little bit. But... If he comes back around, then hopefully I can handle him. 
That sounds a little dangerous, Sylvia. <laughs> I'll be all right. Besides, I'm supposed to have met a friend here tonight. Really? Oh, where are they at? They were a no-show. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, but hey, at least I'm not drinking alone anymore. Her holding her glass, expressing to new friends. Izuku cleaning the glass and going to take a drink. The two trying to chat a bit throughout the night. And Izuku, he is a little surprised. She's very chatty, very interested in him. I mean, he doesn't know a lot about her, but she's so familiar. She's interesting, she's making a little bit more physical contact than normal, maybe. But it's all right. They're having fun chatting, and the night is starting to get a little away from them. And there is currently Deku, who he does go to lay there, trying to think about what exactly happened. God, his head is throbbing, and yeah, last night's a bit of a blur. <laughs> Jesus. All right. He ran into that one girl, Sylvia. They chatted, were drinking together. Jesus, he must have really been knocking them back. But, wait. Oh, why is it smelling like sausage? Oh, God, is he going to have a stroke? Deku going to roll over. Right on him, going to try and grab his alarm. But he does go to grab on something else. Currently, him opening his eyes fully. As he has to see Sylvia laying next to him as his hand is on her shoulder. Morning. Uh, what, what, uh, you, you're in my bed. Yeah, you don't remember last night? Uh, no, not really, uh, sh should I? It's a little, a, a lot of a blur. Oh, um, you offered to take me home. You know, hang out a little bit, uh, talk a little bit, that sort of thing. I mentioned I didn't feel safe coming, well, back to my own apartment. So you made the offer. You're a nice guy, you know that? Uh, thanks. Did, did you make food? Uh, I swear I smell something. Oh, I cooked you breakfast. Also, um, your friend texted you. He said that since you guys took care of everything, that you can come in a little later today? I mean, I think it was your friend. But who's? Uh, well, Jessica? Oh, uh, she, she's my manager. Uh, but I really don't remember last night. I'm, I'm sorry. Is that my... Is that my shirt? Oh, her so I'm going to sit up, talking about it. Going to climb out of bed, and Deku does the watch it. It hangs loosely and is large on her. Her talking about it. She obviously doesn't mind. I mean, her stuff is kind of scattered around. Uh-huh. I, I don't... Uh... Hang on a second. Deku's turning at the alarm clock, which does go to, say, 7.13. Currently, him a little panicky and going to grab his phone, pulling it up and going to enter his password and go to check his text. His friends 
were egging him on, talking about him leaving the bar with the girl. And Deku hears it open the text from his manager. Seeing that it talks about how, since he got done with the project early, he won't have to come in today to finish it. So he can come in a little bit later and get started on the next set for the project. Oh, thank God. You alright? I'm fine. I'm fine. Sorry. Just, uh... I was a little panicky about that. I thought it was going to be late to work. I've got time. Uh, do you want breakfast? I made a few things. You know, some sausage, some eggs. I didn't really know what you'd like, so... I did also make some pancakes and coffee. You made all that? I mean, I appreciate it, but... That's a little much, especially if you just stayed over the night. Oh, uh, sorry. I don't typically do this. I hope you understand. Uh, oh, no, no, that, that's not what I was implying. I'm just... Uh, l listen, th this is a first for me, too. I mean, uh, we don't really know each other that well, and... I, I, I mean, I, I appreciate th this whole thing, but... <sighs> Listen, um, Sylvia, th this is awkward for me, okay? <sighs> Jesus, I don't remember last night, and, well, <laughs> do you want me to recap? Oh, God, just l listen, if I said anything last night, or... If something happened between me and you, I honestly don't remember it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Seriously? Is that why you seemed surprised to see me this morning? Yeah, t to be honest. Listen, I don't really have a track record with stuff like this, so you kind of understand, right? <laughs> it's all right. I'm similar. Deku's staring at her, as she does, does get to talk about it. Some people are intimidated by her sometimes. They don't usually talk with her. And other times, they're a little evasive. They look at her eyes and they see her as a bit of a villain. If that makes sense. But do they? Mm-hmm. They are scared of my eyes. It's simple. I've had a guy tell me before I'd be prettier if I wore contacts, believe it or not. That's horrible. It is. You're the only guy I've met who doesn't seem scared of them. They're just your eyes. <laughs> I think you said that last night. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it's the truth. See, I do like that. Listen, last night we didn't go too far, but you might want to look in the mirror. The mirror? Deku, going to turn making his way into the bathroom and finding his face covered in lipstick. Before he does, take a quick shower and go to rinse off, stepping out in some clean clothes as Sylvia does go to sit there, sipping her cup of coffee and having a little bit of a chat with Deku. As Izuku, he does need to start getting things in order. And Sylvia, she does exchange numbers with Izuku, and talk about how they might see each other Tuesday. Or maybe they can do dinner. Or a movie. Or, well, they can even see about a little bit more. <laughs> a little more? 
Sure. I'd be down to watch movies on the couch and pop open a bottle of wine again. See how it goes. Though, I do have to say, <laughs> you are a proper gentleman. The goose standing there. And currently, she does go to leave. Deku, bring up his watch and... Uh, oh, shit. Uh, he lost track of time. Okay, he already showered. He's got his phone, his wallet, uh, his keys. Okay, okay. He's good to go. And he's got to head in early. Right, right. Deku, taking off. Right now, him getting to work as some of his buddies, they do stand there. When they do get to see Deku, they do congratulate him. I mean, hell. That chick... Yeah. He finally was able to do something fun. He was finally able to get out of the office. And what happened next? That's what they want to know. Deku already does get a clock into work, and his friends do stick together around him. There is him. Trying to figure out where to start and what to do. As right now, there is where Deku is somewhat set there. Tapping with his computer before someone they do to ask. Exactly what happened last night? Oh, hey man. Uh, that's a real complicated story. Is it now? Because, uh... <laughs> I don't think the thing on your neck says it's complicated. The thing on my... What are you talking about? They go bring his hand up. And there is where the other two do come walking up. As David does express. They, they need to check this out. I mean, that chick you took home from the bar last night? She left him a gift this morning. It has seen. Holy shit. I think he might need your scarf. No, I think he might need a turtleneck. What are you guys talking about? Did she kiss me on the neck? Is there something wrong? I mean, come come on, guys. Did you fall on anything? No. I don't think I did last night. I don't think it's what fell into him. I think it what was on to him. <laughs> so, sorry, sorry. It's just... This is hilarious. Yeah, you might want to go look in the mirror, dude. Deku, confused. Before, he has to pull up his phone and go to open his camera. And... Oh, come on. What the hell? So what happened? Did she seriously... Uh, of course. Ah, I shouldn't even be surprised. I woke up with her in my bed and there was makeup on my face. Ooh, that's already off to a really good start. I'm not gonna... talk about it. That's just what happened. Apparently me and her... Well, uh, I don't know. We match well. Oh, so you gave her a matching one? No, 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 uh... I don't think I did. Uh, but th that's not what I mean. This isn't going to be a one-time thing, guys. Me and her know each other pretty well. I've told you before. And we exchange numbers. But she was in your bed. Yeah, yeah. She said I was very... gentlemanly last night. Things didn't get that far. <laughs> Seriously, man. You want to see her again? I mean, maybe. I woke up, she was staring at me, and she made me breakfast, believe it or not. Uh-huh. Yeah, she made coffee, told me a few things were going on with work, so I wouldn't worry. It was actually kind of nice. Seriously, man? 
you want to see her again. I mean, yeah. We kind of visit the same places. I think we like some of the same things. L listen, we talked this morning and she seemed very... I, I, I don't know how to explain it. She's... I want to say good, honestly. Seriously? L listen, I don't expect you guys to understand. I mean, come on. She was nice to hang out with, I think. So you want to try doing it sober this time? Ah, uh, I see. I see what might have been the problem. Okay, shut up. I'm being serious with you guys. I mean, what's so bad about this? I know her. She knows me. You know, one thing happens. I mean, shit. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little. Bavard does come to dating. Though, uh, clearly we're both a little rusty. Yeah, I'm still more concerned with that thing on your neck. I've been staring at it this whole time, honestly. Okay, well, go back to your desk, dude. Alright? Hell, if the boss lady sees you, she's not going to be happy. Yeah, I could say the same thing to you. Uh, <laughs> hang on. I should have a first aid kit in my desk. I'll see if I have a bandage... big enough for that. Him gonna smile. And Deku, he does, gonna turn back annoyed. Still a little... concerned. I mean, Sylvia was there at the bar. He sees her around a lot, and, well, maybe going to lunch would be good, seeing where things go there. But where could they go? Uh, it's a little too soon. W would he come off as desperate? I mean, not really, it does seem, but there are those eyes of hers. They're interesting. They're nice. Hmm. I mean, he can see where she might come off as a little... intense? Uh, kind of. Hmm. Wait, wasn't there a guy in the alleyway? Uh, no, no, not the alleyway. They went out into the bar. No, they, they went out of... Oh, God. They went out of the bar... They left. He wasn't that far away from home, so they walked. Right? Or did they take a car? No, no, there there was a car, but it was this weird guy. Hmm. Okay, maybe... Hmm. Deku, not really too sure. His memory gets a little fuzzy after that. It's a little strange, and maybe he should talk to her a bit more. Try and put together more of the night. <laughs> that would probably be the simplest thing to do. Though he'll probably have to give her a call later. Let's see if she'd pick up, even. That sounds like a good idea. Deku getting right back to work. His friend handing him the largest bandage they can and giving Deku a little bit more shit about the night. With that being said, I do hope you guys enjoyed, and have an amazing day. I'll catch you guys in the next mini-shot.